If you haven't had an opportunity to watch the mid-season finale of Arrow, stop listening now. Major spoilers, here we go. Tonight's episode was called The Climb. This podcast, it's going to be focused solely on Ray Palmer. We finally get a little bit more information and a better look at the Atom suit. Atom, Advanced Technology Operating Mechanism. Atom, A-T-O-M, Advanced Technology Operating Mechanism. It was previously called OMAC, um, but he changed the name because he preferred Advanced Technology Operating Mechanism. And pretty much this thing will shrink and fit into the palm of Ray Palmer's hand. And um, I guess he's going to actually shrink. That's what I'm thinking. I don't know how they're going to do that. So here's my question. Is the Atom the DC Comics equivalent to Ant-Man? That's what I'm getting out of it. Um, the, the suit. Let's talk about the suit, man. We finally get to see a little bit more blue, a little bit more red. And I'm not going to lie, man. Um, <laughs> I got excited tonight because he really 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 is starting to really get into this role um you know brandon ralph it, he's no longer um superman he's definitely ray palmer and we hear a little bit of backstory behind him um when all that stuff was happening in the season of arrow with all those guys running around town and attacks around the city etc cetera, etc cetera. his fiance or girlfriend uh, very close person the last girl that he kissed was named anna and they broke her damn neck in half. Snapped her neck, broke his leg. He wasn't able to rescue her. So he came up with this idea for the suit. And his whole goal is to help save the city, you know. And it's going to be interesting, man. Um, When we come back and, and when we go into season four of Arrow and, and season five, is the Atom going to be part of the team? Because as of right now, you know, you have Arsenal, you have Diggle, you have Black, Black Canary, um, and you have uh, a possible uh, Thea. But they don't really get a lot of screen time, you know? They're, they're just kind of like sidekicks, and the time that they do get on screen, it feels, it feels kind of crazy like a madhouse, man. So what my, my, I guess my hope is, is that whenever the Adam does put on, and he becomes Adam, he, he is, Ray Palmer is actually being the superhero I'm hoping that he gets the screen time that he deserves. That's that's all I got to say about that. Um, tonight, he uh, actually <laughs> recruited, successfully recruited, uh, Felicity. And Felicity said one of the most funniest lines. She was like, why does this always have to happen to me? Because he says, you know, I'm going to save my city. <laughs> I'm going to use this to save my city, this this Adam suit. And she was like, why does this always have to happen to me? And uh, so, you know, I guess, you know, why do I always have to um, pick and choose and fall in love with um, superheroes or whatever? It's funny because, you know, like I said, Felicity's been tossed around like a, a goddamn piece of meat inside of uh, the Arrow and, and the DC Comics uh, TV universe. You know, Ray Palmer, uh, Barry Allen, Oliver Queen, um, <laughs> you name it. Her shirt has been, you know, burned off. It, it's it's crazy. I, um <laughs> It's crazy, but it, it, it I guess in the future, it looks like, you know, Oliver Queen and her will actually have a future since Oliver said that he loved her tonight. So I guess they're going to work on that. And obviously, you know, what that means is, is that the closer that Oliver Queen gets to Felicity, the more danger that she's in, the closer that Ray Palmer gets to Felicity, the more danger she's in. And, you know, the Flash and Felicity should just be friends now from what we've seen. With Ray Palmer, man, um, with him having this Anna situation, um, he looks like he's a little more, a little more controlled, a little bit more understanding, a little bit more sensible compared to Oliver Queen. So that's going to be, I guess, a, a different dynamic that that comes into the um, the universe of the of, of Arrow, and um, I think that if Barry Allen and Ray Palmer um, meet eventually. I think they'll have a lot in common because it seems like, you know, Ray Allen, uh, Ray, I said Ray Allen, I keep thinking of the, the singer, Ray Palmer, and um, <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying that, but uh, <laughs> Ray Palmer and Barry Allen, they'll have um, a uh, a lot a lot in common just because it seems like 
Ray Palmer wants to have justice, you know, true justice, not vigilante justice. Um, and obviously he does want to, a little bit of revenge for Anna, but I think that that still um, keeps him above Oliver Queen as far as his approach to everything. Now, here's my thing too. Will the Adam, will Ray Palmer, will he share the technology? Will, or, or is he going to have Felicity, you know, keep the secret? Um, how is that going to work out? And how, and more importantly, how is the secret that Felicity has about Ray Palmer, how is that going to play an effect on Oliver Queen, his relationship with her, and pretty much the entire group, man? Because, you know, Diggle, he's going to pick up on that immediately. You know, Diggle is, is such a wasted goddamn character, man, to be honest. It's such a waste. It sucks. You know, he's almost like the goddamn Alfred of Arrow. But anyway, I digress. Um, once again, man, the uh, Adam suit was once previously called OMAC. Now it's called Adam, the Advanced Technology Operating Mechanism. Advanced Technology Operating Mechanism. And um, they actually showed you it on screen a little bit closer, like I said. And uh, you can kind of see where there's some sort of device that maybe will... Um, Will, will serve as like an energy um, location, like a beacon, almost like um, Iron Man. And it almost looked like it was like towards his nuts, but I don't know yet. I don't know how that's going to work out. It looks like he has a belt on there too, which is kind of strange, but maybe they're just working out the kinks and stuff, and then once they have the prototype, they'll, they'll, they'll reveal it. Um, hopefully that happens like at the season finale of Arrow. Hopefully. Anyway, guys, that's enough talking about them. I'm out of here. Thanks again for watching. Or listening. All that good stuff. Whatever.